It is Slim the Streamer back with a new video. Smash that like button and subscribe button. Today I want to show you guys how to fix your Steam VR 100%. So I had this issue uh, a few days ago. It took all day for me to figure it out. A simple, simple fix that that shouldn't have took all day. But anyway, I want to show you guys how to fix your Steam VR. So if your Steam has been crashing um, you're not getting updates or anything like that. As soon as you cut the game on, it crashes. Well, this is the reason why. So what we're going to do is head to type in Steam. Space VR. All right. What you want to do is go to Steam VR. Now, you see how mine says Steam VR beta. That's what you want to have. You want to go to properties. You want to go to... Uh, Beta. Yeah, that's where you want to go. Sorry. Uh, you want to go to beta. You want to set yours to beta dash Steam VR beta update. That's it. If you have it on none, then what's going to happen is your Steam is not going to be updated. Your Steam VR is not going to be updated. The beta version keeps your Steam VR constantly updated. So if you keep it on none, then what's going to happen is you're not going to get no updates and your Steam VR is going to keep crashing. And this was why I had issues with my Steam VR because it would just, I mean, literally as soon as I cut it on. Now, I was gone for six days, so I haven't used uh, my computer at all. So I'm assuming that for some reason Steam VR just went to none instead of staying on the beta version. I don't know why, but uh, keep it on the, the beta version. Now, it says at the bottom here, major update introducing Steam 2.12. The release including various bug fixes, quality improvements to Steam VR. We continue to focus on OpenXR as our preferred API for new games and applications. Uh, just keep it on Steam uh, beta VR uh, update because that's going to keep that's going to keep your uh, Steam for uh, keep it updated. It's going to keep it from um, crashing. Uh, it says Steam VR beta update 2.2. Yeah. So this is the updates here, August 8th. And uh, they post updates and stuff like that. So this keeps everything fresh. It keeps everything updated. And you don't have to worry about constant crashes. I'm not going to say Steam won't be a pain. Steam won't be a pain in the rump, but majority of the time it fixes all the crashes and it keeps everything updated, okay? Um, so, yeah, this was the reason why my Steam VR kept crashing. This was the reason why my Steam VR kept running into problems. Um, also, what you want to do is also you want to go to your meta this is for Meta. If you don't have uh, a Meta headset, um, you don't have to worry about this. But if you do have a Meta Quest headset, you also want to uh, when you do. If you're not using, um, if you're not using uh, virtual update, I mean virtual, <laughs> virtual update, virtual desktop, uh, and you actually use like uh, AirLink or uh, Steam Link, not Steam Link, AirLink or your hardwired to your PC. Uh, cause I use AirLink, uh, most, most of the time and I sometimes use Steam VR, but you also want to come here and set it MetaQuest link right here. You want to press this button and this keeps everything in line with itself and you won't have any issues. So this is how I fix my Steam VR crashes and this will help you again, just set it to the Steam VR beta update 2.1. 2.11 and this will keep everything running if you do not have a MetaQuest headset this works for any other headset if you have any issues with steam vr this what works okay and i had no issues after this so thanks guys for watching and i will catch you guys next video bye